Hello folks, Ryan Roxy here from the Alice Cooper Band. I am here at Sweetwater Studios and I have been asked to show you three of my favorite riffs. <laughs> They might not be my favorite, favorite riffs of all time, but they're definitely three of the most well-known riffs of the artist that I play for, Alice Cooper. And I have uh, put them on an order of difficulty from super easy to a little bit more advanced. How about that? And they're all great riffs. I'm a fan. Uh, if you're a fan of Alice Cooper, you'll know all three of these riffs. And if you're just learning guitar right now, um, you can play one with just one string. The first riff I'm going to go through is Alice Cooper's classic 18. And first I'll teach you just on the first string, the sixth string. <laughs> Not the first string, it's the sixth string. Uh, your low E string, if you will. And one finger, uh, one hand, all on the sixth string, okay? So I'll play it very slowly at first and then we'll build up the speed for it. So and this is, again, very beginning type of riff. Um, if you know your first position chords, which is one of the first things you learn when you play guitar, then I'll teach it a little bit more advanced as we go on. So here we go. One, two, ready, begin. <laughs> the sixth string and it's basically one finger all down strokes. Those for super beginners. All right? And you've luckily if you're watching this on YouTube, you've got that little speed control dial under the settings so you can slow it down. And you can get it just like that. I'm tuned to E standard tuning. This will be a little bit more advanced uh, riff of same song 18, but now I'm going to incorporate my first position's chords which will be a C and a D. So it's basically an E minor shape, a little string riff, C, to the D. Again, all first position chords. So, one, two, ready, begin. That should get you started on the opening riff. Now, if you want to go full rock star on you, on yourself, then you can play uh, fifth string power chords uh, along with that riff. So now here is what I'll play on stage, probably later tonight with Alice Cooper. One, two, ready, begin. <laughs> So if you're just learning guitar, get that riff under your belt and we'll come back with riff number two. Which is School's Out. Another Alice Cooper classic. The minute you hear it, that opening riff, every hand in the audience goes up. And um, this is all built around the E 12th fret shape. So this will be my E on the 12th fret because your guitar neck starts over on the 12th fret. And if you uh, don't know about 12 frets and 12 notes and everything System 12. That's my guitar system that I uh, teach called the System 12 Guitar Method. But that's RyanRoxy.com and a whole nother story and a whole nother lesson. But let's concentrate on Schools Out with Alice Cooper. First finger on the 12th fret, then you have these little bar chord shapes that are on the 14th fret and the 12th fret. So again, I'll start very slow and then I'll work it up to sort of uh, on stage tempo. So. One, two, ready, begin. That last note is my third finger hitting the 14th fret of the fourth string. So, speed it up a little bit now. 
and uh, should be starting to get a little bit more in your backbone. You've heard it a million times on Classic Rock Radio. Now it's time for you to start playing it at home. One, two, ready, big <laughs> And if you want to go full on album, do a little pull off at the end of that riff. And this is your extra credit bonus, if you will. One, two, ready, begin. <laughs> So get that, and then now you have two riffs under your belt. But let's move on to the third, which is, of course, the most difficult out of them all, but probably uh, the most well-recognized, at least for all you kids out there. When I say kids, I'm saying 30 years and older. Um, this is in the key of D, and it's Alice Cooper's Poison. Starts off with your uh, seventh fret harmonic. <laughs> guitar uh, shake, if you will, and then it's built around that fifth string power chord shape of D, okay? So I'll play it super slow, and then you can um, bring it up to speed and sort of stage tempo. One, two, ready, go. <laughs> You see I'm using basically just my first finger, my third finger, and my pinky. You know, the pinky is the most underrated uh, finger on your hand. You should start using it more in your guitar playing if you're not already. Um, again, built around that fifth string D power chord shape. We'll try it one more time, a little bit faster. With the harmonic. <laughs> And there's the riff for Poison. Now, if you want to go all fancy schmancy, put some echo on it, get some delay, uh, get some reverb, maybe even a little, nah, no chorus. We'll keep it, uh, keep it pretty straight for that. But again, this is what I would play probably a little bit later on tonight if you're coming out to a big rock show. So, Alice Cooper's Poison. If you want to know anything more about this riff or anything more about uh, what I'm up to, ryanroxy.com is the place to go. And uh, you can start playing guitar. Uh, more of it, that's my entire goal, is to get you guys to play some more guitar. So, third riff, Alice Cooper's Poison. <laughs> Give you a little bonus of the entire solo, so get that under your belt, but don't come after my job. Take care. I'm Ryan Roxy. See ya.